We're here with Mindy White from States at Atlanta Warp Tour, July 26th, Aaron's Amphitheater. <laughs> okay, so I have to start off by asking you about food. Everyone has been talking about the catering. How has the food been? We did Warp Tour in 2006, and the food is phenomenal because me being a vegan, you get worried that there's not going to be like much for you to eat. But I'm vegan too. They're so great here. Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah, they're so great here. I mean, and when I come out, you know, we, we usually do eat the catering here. Um, but they're so good. They, they usually make something and then they'll make a completely vegan version of it so that you're not sitting there kind of like lusting over whatever else right. is eating. So the catering is really good though. I'm okay. probably going to have it a little bit later. <laughs> so yeah. Um, when you pack, what's one thing that you have to bring that you necessarily don't need? Oh. Something you just like. Are, Ooh, I, that's that's interesting. I want to take this. Okay. I don't need it though. Okay. I wear these like sequin sparkly sequin crazy pants every night on stage, <laughs> and I guess I don't necessarily have to have <laughs> them, but I feel like now they're kind of a part of me. And if I go on stage and I'm not wearing them, I feel like I just didn't put my show clothes on. So I would say my sequin pants. Were like, Okay. Um, a lot of girls, when they go on tour or they think about going on tour, the main thing they think about is outfit. Um, yeah. What are you? What are your tips on dressing for outdoor weather, hot weather, and tour, having to live out of suitcase for weeks well, on it? Um, if you're coming to warp tour, just come naked because <laughs> you don't wear clothes and do that. Um, no, I mean it's it's really hard to pack because especially when you're on a tour that's like in between seasons. Um, and you're going all over the place, it's a whole U.S. tour, you have to prepare for every type of weather that you're going to come across. So basically, easy shirts that you can wear in any situation, um, you know, a cardigan or a sweater, and then also some, uh, one pair of shorts, a couple pairs of jeans, sandals and shoes. I mean, just pretty much like pick one item from every season and just have it because you never know. Because I've definitely gone out on tours in the summer thinking that, um, it's going to be super hot, and then I get up to Seattle, and I'm freezing, and I end up buying clothes that yeah. I didn't pack well enough. So, definitely just a couple things from every season, I guess. Right. And I have to ask you, what's it like being a girl um, with guys in a van? Um, um, well, in states, it's a lot easier. Um, it's These guys are a little bit older, and they're really mature, and uh, three of them are married, so they're very respectable. So touring with them is completely different than touring with like a lot of like young guys. Yeah. Who are just like out partying and stuff. I mean, not that that's not fun. <laughs> but you know what I mean? It's right. It's, it's it's night and day, and um, they're super respectable, and they always put the girl first. I mean, they're always like that. Even when I feel like they don't have to be, you know, they're just like super super nice about everything, and they're very clean. So that helps out a lot. Do you feel like it's harder for you in the industry because you are a female versus your guy band members? I do. I mean, well, it's harder to be a girl in general. Yeah. You know. Uh, but yeah, I mean, I think it is hard. It's hard to be respected because there are so many girl-fronted bands. So right. people kind of now, I believe, might look at it as like it's kind of a trend or something. Yeah. But it just so happens that like I'm a singer. It's what I've always wanted to do. It's what I've always done. Not in this band, but I've always done it. And you know, just because I end up going this route and forming a rock band because that's what I love to do instead of going and being a Katy Perry shouldn't make a difference. Right. I mean people should still respect it and any other girl that's out there, you know, taking the time to put their words and their work into music, I mean I think it's it takes a lot. So yeah. um, it's really hard to, to get that um, I don't know, to get that respect sometimes. Right. So. Who are you watching at work for today? Uh, every time I die for a little bit, I love them. I've always been a big fan of theirs. Um, and just seeing a couple friends bands. Yeah. Uh, we found Glory. We're going to watch uh, Alter Blow a little bit later. And a couple new bands I wanted to see. I want to see this band called the Darlings. Darlings? Um, yeah. It's a good time. So, yeah. It sounds good. Um, if you could add one feature to Warped Tour, what would it be? Ooh. Better shower environment. That's what everyone would say. Absolutely. Because... <laughs> I mean, it's the hardest thing in the world. There's like usually one or two showers and you have to fight for it. And yeah. a lot of times there's not hot water. Even though right now you can't think about hot water. But taking a shower, you want hot water. And sometimes it's freezing cold and you just literally get in there and just cringe and just get it over with. So, yeah, bigger shower facilities and uh, more real bathrooms. Okay. And last question, what is your guilty pleasure at the moment? Like, what's the song you've got on replay that... You may not really blast out loud in the car, but you got uh, it on the phone. Guilty pleasure that I love. You know, I don't I don't know. I feel like if anything, maybe I hate to say this, but 
maybe Justin Bieber. Yeah. He's so cute. He's, he's such a great. He's such a great. I saw him live. He's such a great performer and singer. Yeah. So I don't really feel embarrassed, but you know, right. you kind of get teased for it sometimes. I mean, but he's a talented dude. He is. So I think he is. He talented. deserves the respect, but you know, sometimes people pick at you like really. Yeah. But yeah, maybe him. Good. Thank you so much, Mindy, for taking the time to talk yeah. with us. Thank you so much. Hi, I'm Mindy White, and you're watching Music Villains TV.